Hi, I'm Chanda Hetzel and I work out of the Saskatoon RCMP Detachment. And I'm Lorna Janvier from Lalosh RCMP Detachment. We are doing this for the National Indigenous Languages Day. So Lorna, what can you tell me about the Dene language? Uh, the word Dene means people. Uh, there are different languages spoken in, in all parts of Canada, Northwest Territories, Alaska, and the Southern U.S. as well. Um, there are different dialects, like for each region. Um, <clears throat> for example, the one that I know of is for uh, Northern Saskatchewan, like the far north uh, part of Saskatchewan. Uh, they speak a K dialect, as uh, and where we in, I can say, south to them, speak the T dialect. So um, it's it's a similar language. Um, we understand each other, just that the letter makes a difference. So how will understanding some Diné language connect me to the community? I think when uh, the same language is spoken by both parties, there's a stronger connection made and uh, communication is more genuine. Um, if it happens to be the person's first language, the words come out the way it was meant to be said. Uh, people tend to be more open and welcoming to a non-Dene speaking person when they attempt to uh, speak Dene. Um, we actually have a couple of members at our detachment right now that attempt to speak the Dene language and they have a really good connection with uh, community members. That's really cool. So what is being done to keep the Dene language strong in the community? Uh, the schools are teaching the Dene language to the students. It's now a part of their curriculum, whereas um, over a decade ago it wasn't. So uh, parents are encouraged by the schools, the community uh, to speak the Dene, their Dene language to their children. Around our community, I've seen signs or advertisements written in the Dene language, which is really great. Like it's fun to try to read them. <laughs> um, and like if you were to walk down the hallways in the schools, like a lot of the artwork has Dene words and it's actually pretty neat. That's so awesome. And it's great to hear that there's a real revival of an indigenous language here in our province and across Canada. Very cool. Um, so can you teach me how to say hello, how are you in Dene? Okay, um, there's really no word for hello, but for how are you doing, uh, we would say atlanete. Atlanete. Yeah. Say it again. Atlanete. <laughs> like atlanete. The te. te. Atlanete. Atlanete. Pretty close, yeah. <laughs> and I would really like to thank you uh, in your language. So can you teach me how to say thank you? Well, that part is easy. You say masi. Masi. Yes. <laughs> and thank you very much is masi cho. Masi cho. Yes. I like that. <laughs> Well, thank you so much, Lorna. It was really awesome to hear about all the things that are happening with the Dene language. So, Masse Cho. You're very welcome. <laughs>